Hey dog lovers, Christine Fox, founder of Wagon Tails Dog Activity Center, training fabulous, and on a mission to reduce homeless dogs with the greatest tool available, education. So today I'm gonna to give you three quick tips on how to make grooming from home a lot easier. First tip, we make the mistake of expecting our dogs to know what to expect, and they don't. They don't speak English, they don't always know and understand what we're up to. Uh, so it's important that you're consistent with the way that you present your supplies and bring them out. If the brush is just the scary guy that comes out of the drawer in the kitchen, you're probably gonna find that they run out of the kitchen every time you open that drawer. So it's important that you're being consistent with your supplies, they're readily available, and that you're presenting them with, of course, extra special food treats when you break out your gear. So I've got everything ready to go, even my coffee. I look like the Vita Vita Benjamin girl. Um, oh, and by the way, stay tuned to the end of this video because there's always gonna be at least one stupid thing I'm gonna do or say for an outtake. Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook. So I've got all my stuff ready to go, my treats, leash collar, um, my scissors, uh, brush comb. You wanna make sure that you have all the right supplies for your breed as well. Okay, so first tip, have the right supplies and have them ready, ready to go. Tip number two, this one's really important. You wanna make sure that you're teaching your dog an actual command where they maintain a position to accept handling and accept grooming. So Hollywood has been taught to settle. So I taught her settle, and she knows that that means that her face is supposed to, good girl, stay still, so that I can come at her with sharp objects. So teaching the subtle command is what gives you that nice, stable position so that you can get the, the haircut that you're looking for or so that your groomer can as well, okay? So I taught her subtle with just a simple hold, subtle, good girl, and then you can use your food treats to reinforce that. Subtle, good girl. And then use your release word, okay, good girl. We're gonna try that again. Hollywood, want this? I'm trying to do it with this hand, okay, subtle. Good girl, good girl. And by the way, you can use these positions for your veterinary visits as well. Your vet will love you for it. Okay, so again, settle. Good girl. Okay, use your release word. All right, so now I'm gonna start preparing her for coming towards her face with tools. Okay, settle. Now I'm just might even pet her with the scissors. I'm not gonna necessarily use them, but this is preparing her, settle, for what's, what's to come. Uh-uh, settle. Good girl, good girl. Okay, use your release word. Again, I've got everything I need here. Remember tip one, it's so important. You don't wanna be fumbling around and running into the kitchen to grab you know, your treats and oh, I forgot, you know, I need my comb. Have all your stuff ready to go. Good girl. So tip two was teaching subtle. Third tip is again related to obedience training, teaching cues so that your dog knows what to expect. So Hollywood has been trained to stand. Okay, so stand. Good girl, no moving. So now I should be able to come in, grab the feet, and she can expect and know what's coming. Good girl, good girl, no moving. Good stand. Okay, use your release word. Let her shake it off. Good girl. So that again, when I'm coming at her with supplies and equipment, especially buzzers and things that are scary and make noise, she knows what to expect. Good girl. Stand. Good girl. Good girl, Hollywood. Looking good. Okay. Good. That's it. It's very easy by the way, she has a luxating platella, so I'm not hurting her. It makes it look like she has a bad leg. Good girl. She's 12, but she makes it look good. Right, Hollywood? So with these three quick tips, you might make the experience at home of grooming not quite so daunting. Plus, they'll look good when you If you like this video, be sure to give me a like button. Subscribe so I can see you next time. Follow me on social media. I got all kinds of great stuff there. Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook.
Looking good. She needs a friendship collar. So we match. We need you to stay this way. So, Hollywood, we uh, need you to be on camera. Oh, good girl. Are you humping me? Stop. <laughs> I'm your mother, not your lover. Get out of here. <laughs> Stop it. Go away. Don't play, don't put that. 